and it will be done. In Jesus' name we pray. I want you to say, in Jesus' name I pray. Say that again. With authority and assurance. It is done. I said it is done. Father, in Jesus' name, we thank you because you have given us the final word. The final word of authority on every brother, on every sister, on every boy, on every girl. I pray you confirm their word in Jesus' name. Every fruitless tree in your life dry up in Jesus name fruitless tree taking away your money taking away your time taking away your ability taking away your joy taking away your victory Lord I pray dry it up in Jesus name mountain before everyone the mountain you've been afraid of before the mountain you've been trembling before, the mountain that is almost crushing your life, the mountain that is not allowing you to enjoy victory in your Christian life. Mountain, I command you, move out in Jesus' name. In your family, mountains move out. In your profession, mountains move out. In your Christian life, mountains move out. Lord, I pray everything that has hindered your people until this time, whether they are spirits, whether they are their background, whether it is in their genetics, whatever it is, Lord, I cancel every negative thing in their lives in Jesus' name. Your mountain is gone. Your problems are solved. Your sins are forgiven. Your heart is renewed. Your life will be better in Jesus' name. Victory for everyone. Success for everyone. Dominion for everyone. You're now going to be more than a conqueror in every area of your life in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, because I know it's done. I know it's done. I know it's done. In Jesus' name we pray. Praise the Lord. I said praise the Lord. I said praise the Lord. Your mountain is gone. In Jesus' name we pray. And the believing people of God said, Amen. You have all things. Amen. Everything you have asked for from Thursday power night till yesterday Friday till this morning until this very time, the Lord has packaged everything together. Amen. You will see miracle, definite miracles in your life in Jesus' name. Amen. No tears, Amen. no fears, Amen. no anxiety, Amen. no worry. Amen. You, who am I talking to? You will possess your possession. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus, Amen. we thank you for the glorious name of Jesus, for the all powerful name of Jesus, for the mighty name of Jesus, for the majestic name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for the magnified name of Jesus. We thank you for the matchless name of Jesus. We thank you for the mountain moving name of Jesus. Lord, every one of us here, over there, over there, everywhere, we have spoken to you and we have mentioned the name of Jesus. We know on everyone, heaven is open. 
on everyone the doors of heaven are open on everyone the windows of heaven are open on everyone the showers of blessings are coming down lord everything everyone has asked you and we have asked in the name of jesus we have this assurance and i remind your people of this confidence you have done it for every one of us and lord i pray you will confirm the answer in every life in jesus name during this period when the world is at alert during this period when the world is wondering how will this end how will this end oh lord while you are helping the world and while you are giving solution i gradually as the thing died down all your people that stand before you this day no evil will come upon them no calamity will come upon them any symptom, any affliction, anything that appears like, is this not what they are saying? Lord, clear it away in Jesus' name. Lord, we pray for your church and we pray your protection will be upon everyone. We pray for all your children, your protection will be upon everyone. And Lord, we are asking for your mercy for the world in which we live, for our country, for our continent Africa and for the whole of the world, we pray, O oh Lord, this plague will come to an end in Jesus' name. You said whatever we bind on earth will be bound in heaven. Whatever we lose on earth will be loosed in heaven. You said if we shall ask any sin and we agree together, you said it will be done. Lord, we live in a world that needs you. And therefore, Lord, we are praying you preserve the lives of people. That Lord, this sin that is coming, sweeping over all the world, arrest it in Jesus' name. We we'll pray, Lord, everything will come to an end. Speedily, quickly, let it come to an end in Jesus' name. We know you are a God of love, a God of mercy, a God of power. And Lord, we we'll pray you manifest your power in your love and your mercy. Lord, let it come to an end. And while it's coming to an end, let your people remain with the immunity you have given every child of God in Jesus' name. Whatever may happen on this side, on that side, it will not come near the believer. Long life. Long life. Long life. Give to every one of your people in Jesus' name. And preserve us in the faith. Amen. Everything we say will be by faith. Amen. Every deed we do will be by faith. Amen. Everywhere we go we go, will be by faith. Amen. And when we stand on your word, nothing can contradict whatever we desire in your name. Amen. Confirm your power in every life. Amen. Confirm your miracle in every life. Amen. Joy in your life. Amen. Fullness of joy in your life. Amen testimony in your mouth lord we thank you because we know it is done in jesus name we pray another amen a final amen remember all things whatsoever you want others to do to you do so even so unto them and the God of love the God of mercy the God of all grace the God of all power will ever be with you in Jesus name let's pray together father in the name of Jesus we thank you for the revelation of your word we thank you for this word the first the significant, the important, the irreversible, the irreplaceable commandment of love. We pray you register this in every heart in Jesus' name. In every family in Jesus' name. In all our churches in Jesus' name. In every member in Jesus' name. And we pray that this love 
will be demonstrated from every one of us. Number one, towards God, loving him with all our heart, all our soul, all our mind, all our strength, all our skill, all our intelligence, with everything we have, that we love God without allowing a rival, a competitor in our hearts, in Jesus' name. And Lord, that we show practical love, positive love, present day love, unto all the people around us, like you want us to, in Jesus' name. And every day we keep on also receiving your love enjoying your love benefiting from your love and one of these days when the trumpet shall sound and the saints of God shall go marching in your love will keep us until that time and we will be with you we'll be citizens of the kingdom forever and ever we well, thank you because we know you have answered and we know that this love all through this week and the rest of our lives will be manifested in Jesus name. Thank you Lord. In Jesus name we pray. You can say amen. God bless you. I love you. I know you love me too. And one of these days I'll see you face to face. The Lord be with you and make his love established in your life and your family. My love, my greetings to you and to your loved ones. God bless you. Amen in your life. Amen. Amen in your family. Amen. Amen in the fulfillment of the promises of God and the power, the anointing of God upon your life. Amen. Let's pray together. Father, we thank you for what we have learned today. Thank you because we know that this pandemic will not continue longer. We know that you are going to bring a stop to it. All your people are praying. The church of God is praying and the members of the body of Christ are praying praying oh lord i pray bring it to an end and prompt end in jesus name oh lord i pray you preserve the lives of your people that none will be swept or the water that is going under every bridge in every community preserve the lives of all your people in jesus name now the path to continue in doctrine the path to continue in fellowship the path to continue in love the path to continue in the service of the lord give to everyone in jesus name grant us willingness and grant us the steadfastness and grant us the excitement the earnestness to continue your work until you come in Jesus name Lord grant more grace to everyone grant more faith to everyone grant more love to everyone and grant more passion to everyone and grant more success in your service to everyone in Jesus name keep your people abide with your people until we meet again lord i pray your presence will never stop your power will never stop your goodness will never stop in any one of our lives lord confirm it and let us lord rise up everyone without looking back into service for the service even from tonight let us rise up and touch lives and reach lives and transform lives and encourage lives and make lives make people steadfast in the lord in jesus name. remind us of what we need to remember and help us to continue until the end thank you because we know you have answered in jesus name I pray and everybody said amen God bless you the favor of God be upon you and the glory of God shine upon you and the joy of the Lord continue ever in your life we'll meet again until we meet keep on in the service of the Lord the Lord will reward you amen everyone there let's pray together now father in the name of Jesus, we we'll thank you for your word of encouragement, for your word of upliftment, for your word of challenge, 
for your word that commissions us again to go and do the work you have given us to do. Lord, I pray for every worker. I pray for this, my brother. I pray for this, my sister. I pray for everyone that has listened today and everyone that was still listening. I pray, Lord, we will not fail in the work you have committed into our hands in Jesus' name. Lord, grant your people sufficient grace, abundant grace, that this work will not fail in our hands in Jesus' name. Lord, I pray more strength for everyone more courage for everyone and more strength and power to endure to everyone in Jesus name. All the resources of heaven that we need to do this work without failing and to do this work without faltering, to do this work without looking back. All those resources give to everyone in Jesus name. And I pray Lord that your grace will make every one of us to fulfill our ministry, to fulfill our calling and when that day will come the day of the coming of the Lord the rapture and the saints of God will go to heaven and he will examine us and he will he will evaluate what we have done none of us will miss our rewards in Jesus name once again Lord keep your people healthy keep your people happy and keep your people holy keep them heavenly and keep them ready for that coming day in Jesus name all resources that they need power strength everything they need give even to everyone and the joy of the Lord will be the strength of everyone. Thank you Lord because we know you have answered in Jesus mighty name we pray. Let me hear your amen. You can hear my amen. Amen. The goodness of the Lord continue with you and during this time of being so far apart, lockdown, shutdown, isolation, whatever, I pray that this time will soon be over. I'm looking forward to seeing you face to face and the joy of the Lord abide with you until then. Keep on doing the work of God and keep on prospering in the work of God. All your needs are supplied. There's nothing to worry about. You don't have any problem. The solution of the Lord is with you and you'll always have the sufficiency of all things in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Father, we thank you today for this worship service. We thank you for your call upon our lives. And we thank you for our response to that call. Thank you, Lord, because we are saved ourselves. We are born again, sanctified, filled with the Holy Ghost, men and women of purpose. Men and women of passion, ministers and workers and members of priority. Lord, we pray everything we've seen, everything we've heard, everything we've learned will drop into our heart and be fruitful in our heart in Jesus' name. We're asking, O oh Lord, we will not be selfish with the gospel, will not be self centered with the gospel, will not be limited, limiting ourselves with the gospel, will reach out and touch the lives of people around us and people beyond us in Jesus' name. I will pray, Lord, as we touch the lives of sinners, we'll speak persuasively, we'll speak convincingly, and we'll speak so passionately that the people will see this is the way and they will follow the way, and they will have salvation for their souls in Jesus' name. I will pray, Lord, will not leave the work of discipleship and the work of preaching and teaching those who are believers already, so that they can be established in the faith and established in the grace of God. Lord, we pray that this assignment and duty and responsibility of follow-up of discipleship, teaching them to observe all things whatsoever you have commanded us. We pray we'll not leave it alone, we'll be addicted to it and established in it in Jesus' name. 
We thank you because we know you are bound, son. As your people go and you give priority to this work of the Lord, seeking the kingdom of God and his righteousness, seeking the expansion of the kingdom of God, we pray that all the needed blessings you add unto every life to you in Jesus' name. We thank you, Lord, because we know you have answered. In Jesus' name we pray. A good amen. The Lord make you to do the work and make the work to prosper in your hand and nothing will cut short your ministry and your effectiveness in Jesus' name. Remember, start immediately and reach out to people who need your preaching your teaching, your counseling, your follow-up, your discipleship. The Lord be with you God everywhere. Bless you. Let's pray together. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for the teaching of your word. Thank you for the exposition. We know about your humility, about your humanity. And we know about your divinity. We know you came as a siege of David. And yet you're going to reign as the very son of God. And your kingdom will have no end. You have a kingdom, you have a dominion that is going to go from generation to generation. And thank you, Lord, because you have made us part of that kingdom. We pray, Lord, the grace to abide in the kingdom, the grace to be useful in the kingdom, and the grace to remain in the kingdom without looking away, without looking back, without going back from the kingdom, without listening to false prophets, and without listening or taking or partaking of the leaven of the deceptive scribes. Give us the grace in Jesus' name. And Lord, at every opportunity, will give what we have. At every opportunity, we'll not be thinking of ourselves, give me, give me, I want to get, I want to get more. But Lord, of what we have already, cheerfully and willingly, in a practical way and purposefully and because of the gospel, we'll keep on giving and giving and giving so that our life and our resources will be of blessing, spiritual blessing, material blessing uh, to all people around us in Jesus' name. I will stand on your promises that as we give, uh, you'll give back unto us multiplied fold in Jesus' name. I pray, Lord, that your goodness, your grace, your power will abide with all your people. And this word we have heard will move us forward, will make progress in the kingdom of God in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, because we know you have answered. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. I do appreciate you being at the Bible study. I love you, and I love the way you respond to the word of God. May the Lord find you faithful all the days of your life. And as the blessings of God come upon you, I will see, I will rejoice with you because God is a faithful God. He will bless your proper response to the teaching of the word of God. Thank you God be with and God you. bless you. And make the word that is sown in your heart, your life today, fruitful in every one of our lives. God bless you. Let's pray together. Father, in the name of Jesus, we well, thank you for your people, your servants. We thank you for all our leaders, all our brothers, all our sisters. We thank you because we've laid our hands on the plow. We are not going to look back. The strength, the grace, the love, the energy, the passion, the excitement, the enthusiasm to earnestly do it, give to everyone in Jesus' name. For those who are getting discouraged and for those who have any problem oppressing them or, bring, or pressing them down, pressing down on them. We're asking, oh Lord, you take all that discouragement away from everyone in Jesus' name. As we remember the law of sowing and reaping, and we sow and sow and sow again. We pray our reaping will be abundant in Jesus' name. And Lord, as we renew our love for seeking after souls, as we renew our love seeking souls to be saved, to be rescued, we pray you will bless the work and you will bless our service and you will bless our soul winning efforts and many will repent and turn to the 
Lord, in Jesus' name. And as we regain the life of sacrificing, as in the early days when we first knew you, as in the early days when we first became workers and leaders in the vineyard of the Lord, as we regain the life of sacrificing, will not relent anymore, will not uh, cool down anymore, will not uh, go back anymore, we will not allow our love to wash cold anymore. Oh Lord, the passion, the thirst, the enthusiasm, the fire that ought to be in us, bring it back in Jesus' name. And Lord, I pray that as your people keep on sowing every day, they'll be reaping benefits of your promise and benefits of your power and benefits of your provision in every one of our lives in Jesus' name. I pray, Lord, your people will not miss their reward in faithfulness and they will not miss their reward in fruitfulness. They will not miss their reward in everything they are doing faithfully and honestly and cheerfully in Jesus' name. Your promise that one will seek for the kingdom of God and your righteousness, all these other things, all these things shall be added unto us. I pray all the addition of blessing, all the multiplication of blessing, all the mountain moving power that uh, you have promised, everything will come to your people in Jesus' name. Your people will not lack any good thing. You'll be their shepherd every time. You'll be their security every time. You'll be their healer every time. You'll be their provider every time. And you'll provide to meet all their needs and supply. All their needs according to riches in glory by Christ Jesus. Lord, as they bless others, I pray blessings will flow into their lives too. Thank you because I know you have answered. Keep us remembering. Keep us renewing. Keep us regaining the life and the love for sacrificial giving and sacrificial ministry without ever relenting and without looking back. Thank you, Lord, because I know you have answered. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. God bless you. Please uh, go and do what the Lord has said. If the farmer only had a lecture on how to sow, and then he rejoices the lecture, and he's you know, going over the note of sowing and sowing and sowing and reaping, and he never goes out to sow, there'll be no benefit of that lecture. But we'll receive the word of God, go and sow, and great will be the harvest you are going to reap in Jesus' name. We're praying to God who will fulfill all your petitions. We're praying to God who will answer all your prayers. Answer has now come. Brother, answer has now come. Sister, answer has now come. My young brother there, my young sister there, daughter, son, answer has now come. He puts a smile on your face. He puts joy in your heart. Because it's a God who is still doing wonders today. Let's pray together. Let's pray together. If you're sick, you lay your hand upon yourself anywhere you want to put your hand. And with quiet expectation and with quiet faith, we know that today it is done. Father, we thank you for your word. We thank you because once we have faith in you, all the problems are over and the plagues are over, and the pandemic is over, and the pressure upon us is over. Lord, I bring my brother, I bring my sister, I bring every individual, I bring every household before you right now. All the needs in the family, I pray they'll be as a supernatural, miraculous provision right now in Jesus' name. Sickness cannot stand when you begin to work wonders and we consider your wonders and we consider your, uh, your power. We consider the exploits that you're doing. And I'm asking every sickness, whatever name, whatever description, whatever symptom, every sickness I command, be healed in Jesus' name. And any kind of uh, affliction that is trying to destroy the strength of your people, the body of 
of your paper and the cells of your body there i command right now be healed and be delivered in jesus name lord i pray that you send strength unto everyone you send power to everyone you send miracle to everyone lord fulfill it on that brother on that sister on that child on that daughter on that son fulfill your miracle power promise in jesus name you cannot lie you cannot fail you have said you'll do it and we have unshakable faith and we do not stagger at your promise we're fully persuaded it is done we're fully persuaded you have answered our prayer we're fully persuaded all the petitions are answered and I know in every household that has listened to this word, there is a miracle. In every household, there is a manifestation. In every household, everywhere, there is a demonstration of the power of God in Jesus' name. Deliverance everywhere. Miracles everywhere. Healing everywhere. The joy of answered prayer everywhere in Jesus' name. We well, thank you, Lord, because we know it is done. We know it is done. Put testimony in every mouth. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. It is done. It is done. It's a God of wonders. It's done the wonder in your life. Share the testimonies with, uh, you know, our pastors, our leaders, and with everyone around. And tell your neighbors too. You can show them and you can tell them what you have learned today about, uh, you know, the quickening faith, about the quiet faith, and about the quality faith. And as you have got your miracle, they too, as you minister to them, they'll get their miracles too in Jesus' name. Thank you. God bless you. And good night.